is Channel 3 Eyewitness News. We have to just be together and, and, sh and show support so that we can get through these difficult times. First up tonight at 6 o'clock, mourning the loss of Sergeant Brian Mull. The veteran state trooper died in the line of duty in Woodbury during the height of the rain and flooding just last week. And today, really an outpouring of support from people near and far. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Shante Passmore is live from the Xfinity Theater where many paid their respects. Shante. Mark and Aaron, the wake ended just moments ago, but many are still in mourning. And today we saw firsthand the type of support given to the family, troopers and visitors honoring the fallen trooper. A family man, friend, trooper. He was a man of honor, a man of valor, a very wise man and a man that loved his family. Law enforcement from around the region pay their condolences while offering support to Sergeant Brian Mole's family at the Xfinity Theater. He died following a flash flood in Woodbury when remnants of Ida battered our state. We all know that you know, this could happen and um, we want to support the family most importantly and uh, all, of the, all the other uh, law enforcement. While state police offer support for the Mole family, it too is receiving on the ground help at the wake. We're not going to get through this uh, overnight, um, but we do have, we're going to get through it together. Brad Cole of K-9 First Responders brought Nico to help troopers cope. The group is a crisis intervention team where trained handlers use dogs to connect with first responders who've experienced psychological trauma. We have met with some people who were directly involved in the incident. And so they're able to see us again, reconnect, and be able to have a moment of of respite. Cole coordinated with other law enforcement to have more handlers and trained dogs be at today's visitation. While the healing begins, many troopers are remembering Mole as a leader. 26 years under his belt, um, he, he knew what he was doing and he knew how to do it well. And just speaking to some of his colleagues, you could tell that Mole was very much revered within state police. And tonight, an American flag is on display in tribute to Mole's service and life. And tomorrow, he'll be laid to rest after a funeral is held here at the Xfinity Theater starting at 11 a.m. Live in Hartford tonight, Shante Passmore, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Okay, Shante, thank you for telling us more about him. Now, as she just said, it will continue tomorrow, so join us as we remember Sergeant Brian Mole. We will bring you live coverage of his funeral on air and on the Channel 3 streaming news app.